Good morning, Vicky. Rise and shine. Good Hopefully morning. you can see and hear us, guys. Wow, well, Ryan's heading out this morning. We are live. <laughs> da -da -da -da. Good morning, Good Eloise. Good morning, Eloise. So we just had to clean the camera because we the way that we stream this is just simply from our phone. So the camera kind of looks at us so we can see ourselves. So I just had to wipe the lens. One day we'll have this big professional camera with our like streaming. Maybe. <laughs> Good morning, good morning. Welcome to day two of 25. You get an extra five workouts in uh, March. How lucky are you? Well, it does go to the Friday the 2nd of April, but April already. Well, obviously it's not April, That's but it will become April, yeah. I'm going to share an extra shot of coffee this morning. So, today's workout is your upper body and ab workout, okay? You do need some kind of resistance. Good morning. You do need some kind of resistance, whether that be dumbbells, kettlebells, household items. Ray and I are going to be using two dumbbells, but if you only have access to one weight, that is absolutely fine. Everything we do today can be done with just one. We'll tell you at the halfway mark to change, okay? Um, so yeah, if you've not done an upper, uh, an upper, or well, if you've not done a resistance workout with us before, we call it boot camp because. We do boot camps, um, but also our weighted workouts are very high in volume, okay? So bear with us, we hope you enjoy it. And uh, yeah, we're getting nice. We're gonna get warm, so don't skip this part, okay? Do not skip this part. Turn your watches on if you're wearing one. If you're like me, that's for free. Ray's actually got one, but he just never wears it. Just, yeah. You wear it when you run. Yeah, that's true. Right, ready? Let's jog on the spot. Okay. I feel a bit tight today, I'm not going to lie guys. Good morning! Yesterday's workout, I don't know about you, some of the originals, but I've had quite a few messages. Me and Ray were like, that was actually a bit of a struggle. It's <laughs> hard. Right, into hamstring workouts. Coming all the way down, really stretching through the legs. Collapse and really push up, okay? And back to your feet. Today we're going to hurt your arms. Yeah. Basically, you're going to hurt every day with us. So, well. <laughs> but we're going to transform and it will be amazing. That's your feet. Good, one more time. We're all going to go back out into society. But yeah, with someone we'll be like, shut up. We're going to be sitting at pub garden, taking your top off, and then they're going to come over and say, put your top back. Run. What have you been doing? It's not COVID safe, get your top off. Right arm, right leg. Do you know what's scary though? If you're one of these people that, well actually I don't think any of you will be because you're here doing it with us, but if you're someone or know someone that goes, do you know what, I'll just wait until everything reopens. Quite many people. That is, is matter, that is only in like 10 to 12 weeks time. So think of the transformation, what for us, that you can make in 10 to 12 weeks time. Yeah, but a lot of people are going to need 10 to 12 weeks. That's what I'm saying, if they start now. Yeah, don't, don't wait. Yeah. A lot of people expect to see fat loss, um, you know, in a matter of weeks, which obviously you can see some fantastic progress, but to get the kind of body you've always wanted, you're going to need at least 12 weeks. Yeah, so start now. Arm overhead. And you'll be strong when we used to do our garden. when we used to do our competition preps, we would do sixteen week diets, didn't we? And lunges, sixteen weeks goes really quick as well. It sounds better than four months as well, doesn't it? Four months seems like ugh, ages. Sixteen weeks is like right. <laughs> yeah. Change on the contact lens. It's going up today. If you can't see the bottom, then I'll see up. I can see it. Don't worry. <laughs> and into high knees. Shaking it all out, we should be a little bit warmer, a little bit looser. So today's workout is upper body and ab focus. Obviously, we're going to get the heart rate up slightly, but it's slightly different to your hit. Um, it is boot camp with resistance, okay? We have got 12 exercises. They are a minute in duration, 15 seconds in between each one. Oh, Helen, we've got... Six or eighteen effects sizes. Well, yeah, I was gonna hope that Eva was gonna carry on from what I was gonna okay. say. Just you carry on. Then. No, it's alright. You take over. Um, okay, so there is a section one, which is twelve minutes, which is six weighted exercises. 
and there is six body weight exercises. Okay. Once we've done that, we're gonna have a little rest, and we're gonna go back onto the weighted exercises. However, we're gonna be six different exercises, and the second at six minutes, you're gonna be back to the original body weight. Now that sounds really confusing, and Jordan would have explained it a hell of a lot better, but I interrupted her, and then she said, "You carry on." Anything you want to add? I'm glad you uh, complimented me on my explaining skills. Basically, we've got 12 minutes of work. We'll tell you about the second 12 in a minute. Um, after 12, we have a rest and then we go again. Okay? Comprendo. Comprendo. So, with your weights, exercise of number uno, we are going to be in the high plank position. You can do this with your weights or you can do it without because some people get uh, funny about their wrists. Um, you're going to do a press up and then you're going to do two squat thrusts, okay? One press up. You're like, this is not upper body. This is like a bit of hip. Just wait. Um, low impact without the squat for us, just do press ups. All right? So, good hello. morning, Jan. Oh, hello. I can well, see you. <laughs> what you'll notice is when you're doing your press, press ups, your chest, your shoulders, your triceps, they're all going to be working um, in synergy. And then when you do the, the squat for us, you're going to get that burn in the shoulders, you're going to get the burn everywhere. It's just going to make Nothing's it a bit more difficult. Nothing's about this. Okay. Right, are we ready? We've got six seconds. Six seconds. Down we go. Get down. Press up, two squat thrusts, low impact, just press ups. Ready? Drop your knees if you have to. So we're going to have 15 seconds, Let's guys, go. in between each exercise. Warming up the upper body. And of course, you're still going to use your legs a little bit in today's workout, yeah. right? Yeah, this is um, not leggy at the moment. Halfway. You're right, darling. You okay? Oh dear. 20 seconds. And stop. Okay, staying down. We've got a kneeling curl and press, okay? So on our knees, we curl and we press above the head. If you've only got one, 30 seconds one side, 30 seconds the other. Ready? Let's go. Curl and press. So we're going to take the knee and leg drive completely out of it. Are we staying down for the next one? Uh, can do. Oh, I don't know. Might need your feet for Yeah, that. might need my legs for that one. So curl up and press. Halfway, change arms if you're using one. So it makes it a lot harder taking the knee drive out. Fifteen seconds. Whoa, it's burning. Five. And stop. Up to our feet. We have got a seesaw shoulder press. It's going to kill. So on our shoulders, one arm at a time like this. Obviously, if you've only got one, just use one. Three, <laughs> two, one. So here, and then the other one, okay? Oh, this is nice. Rise and shine. Are your shoulders awake now? <laughs> Come on. We say upper body day, but it's basically shoulder days. <laughs> Every time. Basically. Halfway. Uh, Come on. Mia. Why are you sitting in the corner? <laughs> 20 seconds. Come on. Keep pushing, keep pushing, last few reps. And stop. 
job. Woo! We have now got hang it clean, okay? Uh, renegade row. Oh, renegade. renegade row, plank, push up, back to the dumbbells, okay? Right, get down. Sorry, I've got too far ahead. Okay, so renegade row, renegade row, okay. plank, push up, so. Row, row. Oh my gosh! Shoulders. Ah! Drop your knees if you have to. Who made this one up? Oh. Obviously, I didn't. <laughs> Come on, stay with it, halfway. Ouch. Lessons in. Good stuff. Hang cleans. Wow. So here, hang, clean, hang, clean. Okay? Yeah. That was the most burniest renegade bar I've ever done. <laughs> Let's go. Touch the floor, clean up. No, hang cleans. Oh, this is on a board. You can do floor if you want. Oh, might need to. What's wrong with me today? <laughs> Going up heavy with this one. A little hinge from the hips, biceps, shoulders, knees, toes. Wow, halfway. Forearms as well. Come on, ten seconds. Or you can use one, and we're going to come up to shoulder height, okay? Four. Shoulders, maybe. Yeah. Three, two, go. I'm going to use one. Four. We can do alternate in there. Yeah. If you can, we can do both at the same time. It's just we're using challenging weights for us, okay? And you challenge yourself. So up to shoulder height, I go side on. Here, okay? And you're just touching the hips, you're not bouncing off them halfway already. Remember, this is the last weighted exercise. We're going to go on to six body weight after this. Doesn't make them easy, huh? And this is a different type of burn to the body weight hits that we do. 10 more seconds. A little bit more isolated on the individual muscle groups, this one. Simply for the upper body, smaller muscles. And stop. Wow. So, body weight, put their weights aside. Here we go. So, bare shoulder, bare plank, shoulder taps. Okay? Drop your knees if you have to, okay? I'll show you side on. Ready? Let's go. So, knees are close to the body. And we're here. Okay. Make sure your body weight is over the shoulders. You're probably thinking, oh, this is not bad. You wait. You wait till it kicks in. Halfway. Seconds. 
up. To our feet, guys. Oh, Bernie. Okay, we've got a jack front raise, so hands coming forwards as you jump your feet out. Low impact stepping out. Woo, ready? Three, two, one. Try not to touch the hips, okay? Keeping that movement, just down and up. Forty seconds. Halfway. Come on. Keep going, keep going. Twenty on the clock. Fifteen. Less than 10. Stop. Woo. Okay, body weight dips now. So you can use your dumbbells to rest your hands on or just hands on the floor. It's very small range of motion. The dumbbells will give you a little bit of elevation. Okay. Three, two, go. So you're dipping down. Elbows, bum, very small movement. And your wrists will go wherever it feels more comfortable. My hands are facing on raises as well now. But some people prefer their wrists backwards. Just dipping down. So you have to try and keep them abs engaged because otherwise your bum will hit the floor. Yeah, we don't want the bum touching the floor. Keep the bum up. Halfway. Some of you might be bouncing off the floor. That's cheating. <laughs> we just said it and people were like, whoop! <laughs> <laughs> 20 seconds. Cool, right? Oh, it's burning. Stop. Oh, 
Okay, single arm burpee. All right, lots of options for this one. Obviously, both hands if you can't. Single arm, halfway, sink other arm for the other halfway. Okay, follow very low impact, follow me. Let's go. So you're going to sit down, step out, step in, stand up. Or kneel down and stand up, okay? different weighted exercise and we've got the same body weight okay repeated yeah so we're going to go back to the single burn at some stage we've got 12 more minutes so six different weighted exercises this time upper body and abs and then you've just done your six body weight we repeat them again okay hopefully you're enjoying Ooh. this one guys give it a little thumb up like if you don't mind yeah so it's different Ooh. to our hit workouts you should still feel my heart rate is a little bit up, which is all good. I did the single burpee, yay, well yes. done. <laughs> okay, so it shows stability in the shoulder, it shows strength in the arm, and a uh, really big progression. I feel like my right arm's quite good, and my left arm, I'm a bit like, I probably could have face planted the floor. Okay. <laughs> right, first exercise, round two. Watch uh, carefully. Bent over row times two, bicep curl times two. So bend at the hips, row, row, curl, curl. Okay. Okay. Ready? So more weighted, uh, not, not, we won't get the heart rate up quite so high. Let's go. So two rows, squeeze the back, up, curl, curl, okay. But remember we've got 25 days this month, so we're going to work the body in as many different ways as we can. Some days you'll have really, really high volume, very, very limited rest, body weight. Some days you'll have weights, a little bit lower in volume, still higher though. And Halfway. A little bit more targeted on individual muscles. And the reason why upper body hurts so much is because the muscles are so much smaller than like the legs, for example. Okay, so we've got bent over, tricep, kickbacks. Okay, this re will really hurt. If it's too heavy, lie on the floor and do uh, lying dumbbell tricep extensions. Let's go. So keeping your elbows in nice and tightly. It's only the forearm going back, okay? You've got the option of doing one arm and then halfway changes. Man, these are too heavy for me, I think. Got a seven. No, I'm a bit right. I'm just going to do mine slowly, guys. Really hard with tens. I did offer you the sevens. <laughs> Halfway, come on. Oh. Ray's like, I am not dropping my tens. Nah. <laughs> no way. No little rest, though. Come on, feel the back of the arm burn. So remember when you work your triceps, it's just extending at the elbow. So. Arms bent to arm straight, and you'll work the back of the arms. Oh, dear. Arm straight to arm bent, biceps. Stop. 
yourself. No What's more next? then. Upright right. rows. So dumbbells or dumbbell, pulling up. See if you can limit the knee drive. Yeah. So no dipping and pulling. Ready? Let's go. Elbows go high, okay? So from side on, a lot of people tend to lift their wrists up. You keep your wrists down, okay? Elbows come up high. Don't knock your head, but your chin, but come up high, okay? Try not to bounce. All control. Obviously, if you've got tens like row, you'll probably want to bounce. Halfway. Put it places again. Yep. Yeah. So dumb, uh, feet wide, hang, clean, jerk, okay? Yep. Nice and quick with this one if you can. Ready? Go. Whoa! That was a loud one. Wakey, wakey, neighbours. Use your legs, get them weights up. And twist okay so you only need one way and we're going to twist from side to side you can put your legs on the floor if you want or alternatively just do body weight let's go touching the side to side what's he doing back there yes i think she wants to try <laughs> she wants to get out 40 seconds. Do the exercise. Halfway. Come on, hang in there. Stop. Woo! Right, six minutes. 
minutes to go, body weight, okay? Fair play, yeah. shoulder taps. Remember? Let's do this, guys. Come on, six more minutes. Make sure the body weight is over the shoulders, okay? Let's go. So legs close to the body. Remember that one where it kicks in? Yeah. And this one. Come on, touch the shoulder. One at a time, 40 seconds. Legs are burning. Come on. Halfway already. Keep pushing, keep pushing. 15 seconds. So you can go on the floor. I'm going to use my dumbbells just slightly higher. I might try this time. Okay. Are we ready? Let's go. Get them bums off. Such a small range of movement. Oh yes, firing them up. 40 seconds. Ready for them single arm burpees. Can't wait. Halfway. I might do my left arm first this time. Yeah, that's what I did. <laughs> but I think my left side's stronger. 20 seconds. Come on. Ah, 15. <laughs> Three seconds. Ah, stop. Okay, so we're going into our body weight mile makers. So row, row, jump in, jump up. Okay, remember low impact was just the row, row, step in. Okay, you can go on tiptoe as well, get some calf raises. Here we go. Row, row, low impact, you're just stepping in. I want to take Dougie now. Yeah. I'm crying. I don't want to watch Pippi anymore. She's got to say, hey, when she fake cries and she goes, <laughs> now, now she's laughing. Now she's laughing. Oh, God, you've got us wrapped around your little yeah. thing, don't you? Come on, guys. Come on. Got hiccups on me. 20 seconds. Yeah. Woo! 
Down, we've got the low plank jacks, okay, so on the elbows, jumping out the feet. Low impact, step out. You have got the option of coming up into high plank as well. Slightly easier, or hold the plank, okay? Let's go. Keeping the bum down. Come on, five, three, two, one. Single arm burpees. Last minute now, guys. 30 seconds on the side. Obviously, you can do both hands. Low impact. Four step on the other Right, Right, weaker arm first. Ready? Go. Guys, a little rest. Oh, wow. Well done. Have a drink. Um, Absolutely. Yeah, let's know how you found that one. A bit different to the body weight hit, but remember, we've got 25 workouts this month. We're going to mix it up every day. You're going to get the same workout twice, and we're going to work the full body. And we promise you, if you stick with it, you will see the results you want to see, okay? 100%. And I know a lot of females are guilty of this. Just, I mean, I still burn loads of calories, but don't rely on your watch. Just because your heart rate didn't get to your like maximum that you did in the hit, or just because you didn't burn 300 calories, it doesn't mean that you need to go and do another workout, okay? Trust the process, get your daily walk in, hit your steps anywhere between eight and 10,000. Eat well, drink well, do not cut out carbohydrates, and just trust the process, okay? Or if you're like me, I don't rely on any watch like to tell me I've had a good workout definitely, or not. Definitely. I know from the feedback my body gives me. Yeah, if you find that your mind is getting quite obsessed with your watch, I would advise taking it off for a day, just so you can namaste. <laughs> right, we're going to stretch out. If you are um, shooting off, please remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and tag us on social media, okay? Spread the body by JR Word. You've done an amazing job already. Do not stop now. And um, We're going to stretch, so if you are going to stay... Come and join. That was so hard. Oh, well done. Really good. Hey, hip flexors. My ears have popped again. Oh, no. yours? Yeah. Does anyone know the scientific answer of that? Why our ears pop in a conservatory? Sorry. It's weird, isn't it? We're exactly high where we are, are we? Mm -hmm. It might be the, the elevation change of the hip. Maybe. Okay, from here, opposite arm is going to go here. And then we're going to stretch round, okay? Still stretching that hip flexor, but you should feel the stretch in your upper body as well. Bum. And bum. Okay, change legs. So other hip flexor. You're doing your yoga again. No, I need to. I need to do my yoga. This is just what I learned off of one yoga. 
that you lasted two minutes after you were chasing Amelia around. <laughs> Really push forward. Nice. You're going to sit your bum on your heels and we're going to walk the arms forward for the upper body. Really stretching. Chin goes down and forward. And then one arm goes under the other arm. If you can, get the shoulder to the floor. It's nice and relaxing actually. Okay. We just need some like beach music and the Ripley Sea. Oh. And, a, and a beverage. And a beverage. What's your beverage today, Ray? Yeah, uh, what, if I was on a beach? Yeah. Right, chin to chest, arms come forward. Do you know what? I really like the frozen margaritas purely because they're a little bit dry and you just want to drink more and more and more. So. <gasps> do you know what I can do with an Aperol spritz? Oh, How yes. nice are they? With loads of ice. Oh, definitely, yeah. And with a nice juicy orange on the top. Oh, cheeky. Oh. Eyes behind your back. That is, oh. So you know we spoke about our holidays once before we entered childhood life, parent life. We went to Venice for my birthday. It was amazing. We were totally doing, we doing supersets of canal walks, Nutella ice cream and the Nutella ice cream, and, and then we discovered Aperol, didn't we? We were doing super oh, sets. It was amazing, and you never walked down the same what they called like little channels, I suppose. I don't know, but you well, never you didn't because you didn't have a clue where you was going. No, but we found this Nutella ice cream, and we never found it again, and we was gutted. And it was our day going home, and we had our flight to catch, and I was like, I must find the Nutella ice cream, but we didn't find it. So yeah, Nutella ice cream. If there's no Nutella, and the Parliano, whatever it's called, it's like chocolate, strawberry, and vanilla all no, mixed that's in one. Ne Nepotonian. No, it? Nepalo. <laughs> but it's nice. Come it's on. really nice. Okay, guys, thank you so much for joining us today. We hope you enjoyed that upper body blast and ab blast as well. We've got a lot of core engagement there. Um, we'll see you tomorrow for Tabata. So please remember to like, subscribe, tag away. Have an amazing day, and we'll see you for day three. Cheers, guys.